welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Amari, also known as Soul Style Beauty, and I am back with a refill. Today, we're actually talking about the Guys Face FX little, 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 Contour Powder Collection. And this is in the shade Twilight. And what I love about this brand is they have three different shades from the fairest of skin to the darkest of skin. And this palette is actually for my dark skin girl. So I absolutely love it because we know the struggle is when it comes to setting powders, when it comes to contour powders and bronzing powders, especially for women of color. And I felt like this company did a really good job as to like, you know, cater it to us and they're inclusive. So I'm like, of course I'm gonna try your product. This is not a sponsored video. Let's not get that, you know, confused. They did not pay me. This is my own opinions, but I do feel like I've been using this palette on the daily and I love to share products that I truly believe in, especially when a brand is not like a Makeup Forever or NARS or, you know, Fenty, like a well-known brand. This is like, I can tell they're gonna be up and coming. I believe in them. Okay, y'all, so I'm gonna just show you exactly how we use this on a day-to-day -day basis because I have been using this almost daily. I've been having like more minimal makeup days more than ever. And um, yeah, I don't know why. It just felt like, eh, if I don't have time, I'm like, screw it, whatever. But I'm gonna just use this concealer. I almost got in my eye, I'm oh god. Everybody makes that ugly face when they're putting on a concealer, but I'm about to blend this out and then show you exactly how I use that guy's face effect. But yeah, let me know what you guys have been up to. I literally have been like, we started first days of school, so that has been a little crazy. And I'm working on just really being more consistent. I'm like, something like it can't, I can't give up because I love what I do. I feel like there's purpose in what I'm doing, like way be deeper than like the beauty stuff. But it's so hard keeping up with like a schedule and especially when you have a nine to five job. I'm like, oh my gosh, it's crazy. But I know that it will work out one day. So I'll get a grip on it. And right now I'm filming with a new lighting setup. So yes, it's just that I like made it um, my duty to set up like a filming, like permanent filming area in my apartment. Um, so I have like the backdrop up and the lights so I'm ready to film and also I set up a night setup as well so I finally got to do that and I feel like it looks pretty darn good okay so I just finished blending out this concealer I'm gonna use the rest of the concealer okay so now I'm gonna use of course the setting powder under my eye so I'm gonna use that and I'm just using this brush here, I'm gonna tap off the excess and then push the product into my skin. Oh, I almost got this brush in my eye. But I feel like it has like a beautiful finish. Like, I really hope that it shows on the camera how good this looks because it doesn't look very yellow. It's not as yellow clearly as like the banana powder. So I feel like that is so much better for like my skin tone. So, yeah. I'm not mad at it. I like, I like, I like. So I'm actually going to just powder my nose. I don't know, I haven't been contouring my nose as often. So I'm using my MAC Mineralized Skin Finish. And lastly, we're gonna go into the contour and the bronzer. So, leg up. By the way, guys, this powder is super, super saturated. You only need a little bit. You need to like literally tap. <laughs> the same thing that we did with that Fenty highlighter, like tap it, please. Oh my goodness. Mm -hmm. You see, you only need a little bit and it gives you that nice contour shape i'm not gonna go up like you know near my forehead to the side of my face because you don't see it with this pop i like that i felt like that gave a really 
nice contoured look so i'm literally tapping the product like i said you don't want too much like this thing is super saturated so be careful so I'm just gonna bronze the face and you see I use like a bigger brush for the bronzing. So yeah, I feel like that warmed me up super, super nice. So yeah, this is exactly why I love this palette. I think it's cute, it's cute. Definitely for women of color. So we're gonna go in lastly with the shimmer highlight and we're gonna talk final thoughts i'm only going to put a little bit i'm gonna put on my face so yeah guys i'm done using this palette and as you can see it's definitely women of color friendly everything worked well from the setting powder to the contour uh, powder to the bronzing powder and then the shimmer highlight I felt like everything sat well on the skin nothing caked up or looks extremely cakey which I cannot stand it doesn't look powdery or ashy I just feel like this palette is woman of color friendly and like I said I really wanted to refilm this video to do it justice for the product this is not sponsored they are not paying me I did get this product for free however all the opinions are of my own and that's exactly why I decided to refilm because I'm like I've been using this like almost daily and I want to give this product the credit it deserves so I want to thank you guys so so much for watching and I'll see you in my next one bye guys